I'm Doug Doyle with the Art of the Story. Dancer Christopher Taylor was in the inaugural Ailey Camp class in Newark, and earlier this year, Taylor made his N.J. Pack debut with the Alvin Ailey American Dance Theater. Taylor says he loves being a role model to young kids who also want to dance on stage, especially those from his hometown of Newark. When I got in, I was like, I'm going to go back to Newark. I know Ailey's going to go back to Newark, and, you know, it's a, it's a beautiful thing to sit with. Um, I feel like there's a responsibility. You know, um, so I take it head on and with, like I said, with uh, humbleness and grace, because um, I think it's, it, that's very powerful, you know, to be an example for your city. Dancers in the company that I saw in Newark, you know, is the reason why I'm here. Um, inspiration goes a long way, you know, when you allow it to fuel you during your lowest times. So it's just it's um, it's a huge responsibility because, you know, I know we examples can take you so yeah christopher when did you know you had the goods to become an alvin ailey american dance theater performer yeah i, I think um in middle school when ailey came into teach like some people from ailey came into like uh, teach us um like modern like horton steps when i was younger and then they showed us a video of Alvin Ailey and the company and Alvin is Alvin Ailey's blood memories. And I think like something honestly turned on, like that was a very pivotal to see it. Like I'm very visual, a visual person so to see that on, on the screen. I didn't know the world until I saw it on that TV until I saw like, okay, it's like, it's just not like ballet and like tutus and stuff. Like there's more or, or hip hop. There's more to dance than like ballet and hip hop. And when I saw it on TV, I was like, I wanted to be that. And I know I'm good enough for that. You know, I knew I had a lot of support from my grandmother, my dance teacher at the time that came from Ailey under Ms. Nasha Thomas Smith. And, you know, I was, I, a lot of people gave me support, but when I saw it on TV and like learned more about Ailey, I felt like, yeah, I'm, I could do it at a young age. You can see my entire interview with Christopher Taylor, fellow dancer Shelvar Montero of Montclair, and the company's artistic director, Robert Battle, on the WBGO Facebook page. I'm Doug Doyle, WBGO News.